curse our house of horrors. You guys have your costumes ready? Yeah. What's the secret? Me and Manny came up with something together. I love that. Can I have some candy? No. How about you, Alex? Well, I haven't really thought about it. I've got, like, three huge exams tomorrow. Honey, you can't just slap something together at the last minute. You know, if you gave this costume half as much time and attention as you give your homework, you wouldn't be in this situation. Can I remind you, you have one child who's not mediocre? Check it. I'm a scary black cat. The only person that costume scares is me. Go change it. To what? I don't know. One of your old costumes. Honey, trust me. I am sparing you an entire day of guys asking you if you have a rough tongue. Ew. What the hell is that? What? You told me to put on an old costume. Not from when you were eight. You're trying to get candy or Japanese businessmen. Change it. Go. Jerry is a no-go on the crow. You've been over there this whole time? Yeah, he was venting. I couldn't break free. God, you are sexy. Honey. Not so fast. I don't think we're done here, my darling. Sophie, I need to get down. Oh, we can get down. We can get way down. Oh, God. Oh, hi, honey. Breakfast will be ready in a minute. Very funny, Mom. I know it's Halloween. Nice fake hand. <laughs> we love Halloween, especially Claire. It's my favorite holiday. Ever since I was a kid, I loved scary things. If there was a new horror movie in town, I was the first in line. One, please. Mm. I'm at Phil. Two, please. Bring it this way. This way, there it is. Perfect. Thank you. Perfect. Claire. Why? Can you ask Gus to fix that light? I asked him, but he just growled at me. Oh, gosh. Okay. Guys, stop scaring Bethany and fix the light, please. Don't make me come over there. I'm busy. You fix it. Is this because I said I wouldn't come to the dance with you? Gus, I'm a married woman. People would talk. One dance with me, you forget all about it. Yeah, I already have a husband who doesn't fix lights. Please. Thank you so much. <laughs> this school would literally fall apart without you. Oh, well, I don't know about literally, but... Hola, hola. I'm here. Oh, you came anyway. It's great. I think it's great, too. A few weeks ago, they asked for someone to be in charge of the school dance, and I volunteered. The school asks for volunteers so that everybody will feel included, but who are they kidding? They want me to do it. I put on every school dance since Haley was 12. It's my thing. They made us co-chairs, which means we're supposed to do everything together. But Claire won't take any of my ideas. She suggested an Arabian Nights theme. Isn't it a little soon? Okay, um, hey, everybody, do you know Gloria, Manny's mom? She's here to help us out today. I'm the co Oh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so the kids are going to be here in two hours, so everybody back to work. Everybody back to work. I just said that. And I just co-said it. Too, Claire. Because everything is your thing. This, this is the one thing that was my thing. This is my only thing. Oh my God, this is my only thing. And then you come along and you steal my thunder with your tight dresses and your great ideas. I was the one that all the moms looked up to. I was the only one that Gus liked. Oh, please, if you like him so much, you can keep him. It's not the same now that I know he likes you. That sounds really insane, but this isn't actually about Gus. Oh, really? Because you've been talking a lot about him. Gloria, Gus is a symbol. A sex symbol. Oh, stop it, Gloria. I'm already crying. <laughs> Claire, I didn't come here to steal your thunder. Your thunder is your thunder, and my thunder is my thunder. I know. It's just that God gave you so much thunder. Yeah, maybe too much. I hate how those women look at me. You think I don't know what they're thinking? Ah, oh, here comes the hot one with the big boobies that is going to steal my husband. And maybe they don't let their kids play with Manny. Volunteer because I want them to see that there's so much more to me. Why didn't you tell me that? Yeah, maybe for the same reason you didn't tell me you had a weird thing for Gus. It's embarrassing. Okay. I am sorry. I made this whole thing into some ridiculous competition and I'm pathetic. You're not pathetic. <sighs> okay, that's a little bit sad.